73, northeast winds 12 miles per hour, all green light gold, no weather threats for the islands in terms of any kind of wet weather or strong winds, even the surf is low, and the cool northeasterly trades, which, you know, a lot of people tell me that they love, uh, that will remain over the islands, and that means the overnight lows are going to be in the mid to upper 60s, nice and cool, no need AC, no need the fan, we have it naturally from mother nature this area of weather here this uh, this white cloud area that is a storm front and that is going to fuel showers for the islands starting on friday and into the upcoming weekend it is not a storm system but more like storm remnants so that means for us windward and malka showers are going to start ramping up and things will be wet for east facing and north facing shores of the islands this weekend but it's still going to be a uh, situation where there's beautiful weather. Until then, mostly dry conditions right now. This is one of the drier nights that we've seen so far this week with those windward Amalka showers racing through, but there's just not much of it, even offshore. Even compared to last night, there's been few and far between, just a little bit in West Maui and, of course, East Maui and the windward sides of the Big Island. In surf, best we got, three to five. North shores, two to four west and south, and one to three for the east shores with a small craft advisory for the windier channels of Maui County and the Big Island. So we have a consistent weather pattern, a very stable weather pattern through Thursday, and even through the weekend, it's gonna be quite stable. However, a few changes for the weekend. Number one, more windward showers due to storm remnants. And number two, the trade winds are gonna weaken to the point where we might lose them as soon as Sunday, perhaps even in through Monday. Bridget, over to you.